Um, what did you do? What are you crafting? Are you crafting? Are you hanging out? Are you watching the TV? Are you, what are you doing right now? And um, did you have an amazing week? I would love, love, love to know. I'm just setting it up so you can, you can see better. Um, I want to say hi to everyone. Happy Friday to all the friends that's here. Thank you for all the thumbs up. I want to say hi to um, Bonnie and Lauren. Hello, hello, hello. Maritza, Diane, Erlinda, how are you guys doing? Miss Jennifer is here. Gina S., how are you? Catherine, how are you? Miss Teagues, Miss Bab is here also. Thank you so, so much. Thank you. Thank you, Bonnie. Thank you, Bonnie, for, for the thumbs up. So, um, I just fixed the screen, so that's good, good, good. Um, posting all my recent layouts on Instagram. Thank you so much. We would love to. We would love to see. Um, I hope that this view is okay. How are you doing? What are you up to, Miss Anna Powell? How are you? So today, you guys, just a recap of what we did last week. I think in one of the Friday lives, I forget if it was last week, but we recently made the mini the mini pocketbook okay this is the mini pocketbook this is what the prototype looks like hi joanne uh, how do you say is it joanne or joan joan because other people say it different you know i'm excited to, that you're here anna thank you so much love 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 it so this is a we call this a mini pocketbook um and it uses the chaos crafts dies if you don't want to purchase the die, you don't have to if you don't have the resources for that. It is available in Amazon. It's very convenient when you die cut it, it has all the pockets. But obviously, if you want to make the pocket yourself, you can. That's not a problem. But this is what it looks like. And I'm still going to give you... Um, I have it I, I have it in one of the lives. Um, so you can easily make it. Hi, Grandma Jo, Cheryl. Hi, Erica. Welcome, welcome. I always forget. Thank you, thank you, Bonnie, for the reminder. I got a bunch of um, commitments for crafting, but working on six days covering my mother's shifts because she is at the Ark in Kentucky for 40 days. I'm going to be, oh, you're going to be nuts busy. Oh, that's intense. At least crafting will help you kind of decompress. Robin, see you. Where have you been? How are you? Thank you for being here. So this one is the prototype. This is the blank one. And I think this is what we made in the live right here. We made this during the live. I just added this sloth. And then just if you don't want to put embellishments, you can put stickers. It would be great for swaps, I think. I think it would be great for swaps. Didn't get to a Christmas in July. My friends were busy. That's not a problem. You can do whatever. You can do Christmas in July any month, you know. Christmas in August, yes. We do have um, Hello Kitty Month is in August. And stay tuned for some projects. We have a hop on the 27th of August. And we have some special friends that's going to be joining us for the hop. And they're going to be showing you projects that they made. I will be showing you how to make this in the future. Some tutorials for Hello Kitty Month that I have lined up for you. But that's, that's going to be in August. And that's always, always, all the tutorials are available for free for you guys. Um, yes, you don't need a die to make this one. The die makes it easy, but you don't necessarily have to need it. Hi, Annette. So this one is what I did. I added a lot of Pusheen stickers everywhere. I think it made it so, so cute. And then... Um, look how cute isn't this cute for a swap oh my gosh this would be so cute and then you i guess you can put some embellishments right here if you wanted to like some thicker embellishments whatever you want i'm, I'm not doing that i don't have any pusheen embellishments but that's what i had on my table and then when you open it up you can see all the other i suppose i i it's supposed to be arranged but i guess it kind of look how cute are the stickers aren't they so cute it's so cute to see them all hanging out right there i do christmas all year yes 2020 december daily <laughs> hi annette how are you i know alicia can't join the live because she's blowing up some balloons for our friends this birthday 
So this is what we have. And this is the, the it's called the mini pocketbook. That tutorial is available for you in my channel. But that's not what we're talking about today. We're talking about, oh, Susan. Hi, Susan. Thank you so much. We're talking about, since this is the mini pocketbook, we're going to show you how to make the major. <laughs> I don't have a name for it. The mini and the major, it's fine. Major pocketbook. It's going to be thicker. It's going to have four pockets and you know it's gonna be it's gonna be fun i think it's gonna be fun um welcome welcome susan thank you for being here yes you love i love pusheen i think pusheen is super cute and has not been given any credit in the cuteness world so this is what we're making i've showed you this one time before and this is a major i call it the major pocketbook and that is what we're going to be creating today. I try to put the instructions on my prototypes together with it because all the books, my, my instruction books, I have multiple. So I have to go back to it, which is so inconvenient. And I end up not finding it. Um, <clears throat> watching Hallmark. Oh, I love Hallmark Christmas movies. Seriously, I love Hallmark Christmas movies. They just have a different lightness to it. I think it's awesome. Hello, Miss April. How are you? So this is our major pocketbook. As you can see, there's two sides. This one has a top. And you can... This is perfect for swaps, my friends. You can easily put um, a sticker. This one, I also added a sticker. I just folded the Buenos Dias sticker and made it fit right here. I used last year's Buenos Dias collection... And then this one, it accommodates four pockets. It's, It has a lot of space for you to put goodies in if you're in a swap. Or if you want to send happy mail. So see, you can do anything. You can put tags. You can add stickers, embellishments. I even put a 3x6 mini album in here. You know, that would be so perfect for swap so you close this this front this one first then you close this and then you close it like this if you want to when it comes to closure before before you attach before you attach this flap that's when you add the ribbon if you want to use a ribbon as a like a closure if you wanted to um thank you thank you thank you Thank you so much. Hello, Fatima. Hi, Audrey. How are you? Love the Buenos Dias collection. Working my there. Yes, it is so, so gorgeous. I love, love, love it. So this is what we're going to be creating. I have taken the liberty of putting the detailed instructions for you over there um, in the description box. So if you want to print that out or um, create, if you want to create with me, that would be super awesome as well. Hi, Grandma Jo. How are you? So this is what we're doing. Close it right here. We close it like that. This closes right there. And then obviously you can create more pockets if you want to on here. That's up to you. If you want to create a an accordion, up to you. But this is what it looks like. Solid construction. You can expand it because the spine is very, very big. So you can put more stuff inside if you prefer let me see if i can put a mini just the thickness to it you can even put a mini pocketbook in there and it's still going to accommodate it obviously the height is not the same but that's that the point is it can expand for you if you want to you have to use it it's so so much fun to play with bonnie I'm good or out from work this week. How I, I am good. I'm working this weekend, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. So that's why I'm live today and I'm so excited to be here. Um, so let's get started. Uh, if you want to join me, the in, the this in the description box is where the instruction is. So I've taken the liberty of cutting the papers. This is your base, and this is a 12 by 12 inch paper. And then this is the decorative portion and front and back. And it's four and a half by seven and a half. I did two of that. And I put stitching. This is the pocket, the decorative pocket. And this one is four and a half by seven and a half. Everything is in the description for you. 
I also cut four pockets because you're gonna need you're gonna need four pockets. One, two, three, and four pockets right there. So I took the liberty of cutting that so we can just easily attach it. And then this one, what is this? I think this is the top flap. This is the top flap, and this is four and seven eight by seven and three eight. And then the side flap is this one, which is five and three quarters by seven and three eight. Again, everything is in the description box. It is so cute. I am in love with this collection. So in love with this collection, Auntie Catherine. Seriously, love it so very much. So let's get constructing. So your base is a 12 by 12 sheet of paper. And then this is what it looks like. You're going to start scoring. The first score you're going to do is 5 inch. And you're going to score every quarter. So 5 and 1 fourth, 5 and a half, 5 and 3 quarters, up to 7 inches. So 5 and 3 fourths, 6, 6 and 1 fourth, 6 and a half, 6 and 3 fourths, and 7. Okay? That's the first. Hi, Angel. How have you been? It's been a while. And then you're going to turn and you're going to score at three and a half and four and 11. Okay. So that's what we're going to do. And then we're going to process this. You're going to fold and burnish the score marks. So that's what we're doing right now. I've already burnished, I've already like started burnishing on the spine. This is what it looks like right here. And then this one as well. And this is the actual. Okay, so that's what it looks like. And this is what it's going to do right there. So if you can imagine, if you can imagine that's what's happening, we're going to make our cut up to the second score mark so first and second score mark you're going to cut up to the second score mark okay so this is what you're gonna do i i prefer that you guys cut and then use it as reinforcement in my designs versus just cutting it because i think it adds to the bulk it adds to the stability of your project if you just cut and reinforce. Okay. Hi, Babs. How are you? Welcome, welcome. This my year mental health has been trending up and I lost 100 pounds. Oh, my goodness. I don't know if that's good, if you wanted to lose the weight or not. But yes, mental health is indeed so, so important. So what I want you to do is I want you to attach this with your glue. For the bottom portion, for the bottom portion, you do that, you do that as well, okay? So I'm going to use my Barely Art. And I'm going to use this one just for, ex for expeditious process. Okay. Because this is the right height. You're going to notice that I tend to do that instead of cutting it. Because I think it's going to be. It's going to be better. Okay, so. Right there. And then this one you're going to glue. So we're going to use the Barely Arts for that. Thank you, thank you, Bonnie. Good grief. I was waiting for a live to start. Nothing was happening. So refresh and it started. <laughs> I'm glad you're here, Gina. <laughs> Congratulations, Angel. Yes, yes, yes. Congratulations. I, oh. I know weight loss has been always a thing for me. It's always a struggle. And I've never been able to keep it off. So... I am, I'm so, so happy for you, Angel, because, yes, it's such a big, big thing to be able to lose the weight. You feel lighter, um, and I, I want to do that, too. I want to lose some, I want to lose a bunch of weight, 
because you know you're getting older you gotta start thinking about health health is wealth hey roey girl how are you how are you i'm so glad you're here so this is what we have so far my friends so remember the decorative portion this is where it's gonna go You see, that's where we're going right there. Anywho, so we created the base. So make sure that you burnish and everything. The decorative part, let's put the decorative portion right now. So see, this is what it's supposed to be. This is what it's supposed to look like. Isn't that pretty? That is that. So I'm going to attach it already. Yes, I am doing the virtual retreat, Barb. I'm so, so excited. I am. I just cannot. I cannot wait. I love, love, love. The Lake Lottawashi retreat is so 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 much fun i've attended i think three already you guys three craft chicks is having their annual summer retreat and it's a virtual retreat you don't have to travel anywhere you can just get the retreat box from the website i i hope they still have some left um I want to start exercising too. I hurt my back. And so yesterday, me and Lexi, we went to the gym and went to the treadmill for the first time in about maybe a month and a half. So I'm glad to be back there and starting up again with my journey to health. Congratulations, Angel. It's very inspiring, honey. It, it does help with pain. Yes, I have gotten my box, Barb. But what about you? Did you get yours? I know they haven't. Sh they're shipping this coming week. I know they're shipping already, Barb. So that is our cover page. Look how pretty. Isn't that pretty? <gasps> I'm so excited. This looks really, really good. Okay, next, let's deal with our, our top flap, which is this one. So let me see. It's been a while since I've done this one. So I think, yeah, it doesn't require much. It's just putting it in here. <laughs> I just have to glue this. I just have to glue this right here and it's good. That was easy. This is our top flap. I love making sure that it's all reinforced. So that when you when you do your project, it is solid, right? Okay. Okay, so let me put this here. Okay, you guys, don't forget that everything is in the description box below for you, okay? All the measurements is in the description box. And then you attach the same thing right here. I just want it to be symmetrical. Uh, my mother has rheumatoid arthritis. She, she cleans houses every, every day. She gets home. She gets in the... Wow, that is impressive impressive i'm very happy that you're here roey um is there a washi in the lake washi retreat <laughs> coming monday yeah that's perfect um oh my gosh i'm so excited let's do it all together i'm so excited that you guys are coming somebody something fell apart yes absolutely you know having stability i think is really really important because you know you you spend your resources, your time, your creativity for a project. You don't want it to fall apart. So that's really, really, really important. I love, love, love it when people send reinforced or solid projects. 
I, I always try to make sure that if I'm sending something to someone that it is sturdy and it's going to it's going to survive shipping, you know. Okay. Let me do that. Because it's important that it's sturdy, right? Next. Next, this one is your side flap and we're going to need we're going to need our scoring tool for this. Thank you so much. Okay. All right. So this one is your side flap. And the side flap is 5 and 3 fourths by 7 and 3 eighths. Okay. So at this side, the 5 and 3 fourths are going to score at 5 8 and 1 inch. Okay, and you're going to do that for the same five eight and one inch. Okay, why are we doing this? Because this we're going to put as a side flap. But guys, don't forget, be mindful that this is a left and right. Okay, it goes left and right, and be mindful of your prints. I just want to make sure that you you are being mindful of your prints. I don't want you to waste the paper. Okay, right there. So this is for your right and left side, and you're going to attach it to here. So this is your top flap, this is your side flap right here. So this is where this baby is going. Okay. I try to use the Barely Arts if I feel like I'm not gonna be able to make it center. Like if there's any room for error that I needed, I try to use the Barely Art because that's, it lets you kind of move a little bit. It dries quick, but not quick enough that it, you know, compared to, you know, compared to like um, a hot glue. And then this is where we're going to put it. I'm going to put it right here. So you know you get the you get the gist of it. Okay, next. Okay, we're just gluing it right here. This would be you guys, this would be perfect for swabs. I do resin and paper crafting and do clay. Oh, I love clay. Yes, it's very hard. It's very hard. I moved to Nebraska to Iowa, bought another house. Been busy. I'm so glad that you're here, though. I'm so, so glad that you're here. Huge box from my friend Trina. Again, she's texting me to do a video. Oh, if I take the side of the box, I'm going to do with it. Um, it, it does sound fantastic, doesn't it? Sounds so fabulous. I want to make sure that it's symmetrical. I know it doesn't matter. That small millimeter doesn't matter. Hi, Cousin Sandra. How are you? Welcome, welcome. Thank you. Thank you for being here. Okay, so this is what we have so far, my friend. Okay. Next is we can decide to put these right here. We're going to put these now right here, I think. Let me grab. Yeah, I think that would be so perfect. I think that would be super cute. And then you just need to attach it. I think the, the wet glue is perfect because it allows you to be able to realign everything. Hello, Miss Heidi. How are you, Vera? Welcome, welcome. 
Claudia, welcome. Happy Friday, my friends. Okay, so I'm going to... This is called... What we're doing is we're doing the, the major pocketbook, okay? And I believe that this is a really sturdy project that you can be proud of when you make it for your friend, for your swap partner, or if you want to include a gift card, some cards... You know, some handmade cards, you can. And it's such a creep project, especially if you want to do Halloween swaps, Christmas swaps. Um, and you can create your own pockets if you wanted to as well. But look how easy. It feels intimidating, but it really isn't. It's super easy to create. I'm so, so glad you guys are here today. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you for being here. And then this one. Obviously, you guys, if you want to put another pocket here, you can. So that gives you six pockets. You could if you wanted to. That is that is like room for growth. Or you can add more like layered embellishments. It's up to you how you want to, based on how much you have to swap, you know. This is so cute. Thank you, thank you everyone for being here. Lisa, hello Lisa, welcome, welcome. So this one is our major pocketbook. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. Okay. And then, so all of our major pieces are in here. The fun part is loading it up with embellishments, I believe. Hello, Miss Debbie. Oh my gosh, she's positive for the virus. And it was put on meds. Two days later, I was positive. Oh my goodness. She bounced back very quick. You're still feeling yucky. I'm so sorry, Miss Debbie. I'm so sorry that you guys are sick. I hope you feel better soon. Hello, Miss Maxine. How are you? Thanks for being here. I'm about to be in a swap. And I need to make my first embellishment book. This would be so perfect for you. <laughs> Maxine, I have, I have in the description box the, the measurements. So you can... You can easily use it for your swap. That is... Look how easy that was. So easy. So easy. Okay, so this one. I'm just decorating the back. It would be cute if you, we make a dangle. That would be absolutely adorable. I haven't made a dangle in such a long time. Oh my gosh, I went to the thrift store. If you guys happen to come to California, there's a thrift store close to my house. And they sell ridiculous, ridiculous. I am not kidding. Me and Mimi, we went there and we bought punches and dies. And these are Sizzix dies, you guys. Sizzix dies. And it's awesome. Did you see the Sanrio die cut embellishment Jenny made? Yes, I did. It's phenomenal. She took another test. She's going to be positive for a while, Debbie. She's going to be positive for a little bit. Um, I'm sorry that that happened to you to you both, you and your you and your daughter. I'm glad you guys are okay. Okay, let me put I want to put a doodle bug um tag I think it's going to be fun. Oh, Sanrio die cut embellishment book. That would be insane. Mm. Oh my goodness. That would be so much fun. I love the idea. I hope you feel better soon, Miss Debbie. Oh my goodness. Um I'm no, I'm positive she's negative. Oh, okay. 
so you still have it and you know you got it later after her so you're gonna be positive longer than her for sure i hope you feel better lots of fluids okay lots and lots of fluids on vacation kitty and ready to rest and craft i'll be making a few of these books i love it thank you so much thank you so much for creating my book i am so happy when you guys use my tutorials it just gives me joy that you that you like it enough to make to make it it gives me so much pleasure seeing that you make my book you know this would be so perfect for christmas swaps you guys wouldn't this be so perfect I'm going to put it right here just to make it look legitter. Look how cute. <laughs> just a brand name. Okay. And then you have to go. Bye, Rowie. Have a good night's sleep. Have a great weekend. It looks, yes, it's very efficient. But Hello, Miss Wilma. How are you? So I think I need to cut this a little bit. Happy Friday, Miss Wilma. So I'm just going to cut this and just get it out of the way. So I'm cutting it at a diagonal. I don't know if I could do this with my right hand. We'll see. I'm cutting it at a diagonal and I think I need to add something I think it matters you know it would be cute if you put a dangle right here I just don't have a ready dangle right now lots of water yes 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 hi Tina mama Tina how are you where's Christina okay so yes a dangle would be so cute oh my god no, not that. That's too big. I don't have a dangle. I don't have a dangle available. But look how cute this is already. I'm thinking this would be so cute. Is that too dark? But I do want to put... I want to put a pocket here for sure. But let me measure. I don't think I have that in my measurement. I don't know what I did. But I thought I had it, but I really don't. Let me look. So I'm going to measure it. It is 4 and... 4 and 7, 8. Let me get four and seven eight in width so with four seven eight we're just gonna go just do it on a fly and then this is about about three and a half okay so what we're gonna do just for fun is we're gonna put a pocket right here which was the original intention but i don't have that in the description box because I don't know what happened. We will do it anyways. Let's just go for it. And I want to use this. Maybe I don't want to use that paper. I want to use a prototype paper. Give me a sec. <clears throat> Yay. I have an idea. I'm going to use my prototype paper. Yes. You know, you know, I need it. Okay, so three and a half would be seven. Okay. So three and a half width is three and a half in the height. The width is four and seven eight. So four and seven eight, so half. And then I'm going to measure four and seven eight. Okay. Just, just go with me on this, my friend. Okay, so five and three. One, two, three, four. Okay, next. Half. And then half. So eight and a half, seven and a half. We're going to do three and three quarters. So one, two, three three and three quarters okay so i will give you the measurements oh my gosh anyone know the answer to my question okay sorry 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 um let me look at your question what is your question again claudia i'm so sorry 
Um, I saw Lauren good movie. Husband likes it too. I missed. Hi, Judy. How are you? Welcome, welcome. Wait, what is the question, Claudia? Let me backtrack. Uh, how are you doing, ladies? I don't see your question, Claudia. What was your question, my friend? Oh, if I've had COVID for two weeks, if I take the test, it may still be positive. It may still be positive. Sanrio Die Cut Embellishment book. This would be perfect. Yes, absolutely. This would be perfect for a Sanrio embellishment book. Um... Such a great size. Thanks. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Miss Judy. I love Hallmark movies. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so let me write this down because, you know, I always do the stuff and I don't write it down. So, 5 and 7, 8 by 8 and a half. Okay, so let's look at our thing. So this would be okay so this would be our measurement um, at eight and a half it's gonna be half on both sides oh no five and seven eight it's gonna be half on both sides so one half and four four and one fourth Four and a half and eight and at the five and a half it's half on both okay so that is our measurement and then we're going to okay so I do like them I do like it reinforced I don't want to. Yes, absolutely. Try to try your very best to quarantine yourself or wear a mask if you absolutely have to go. Like if you have to go to a doctor's appointment, wash your hands, use sanitizer, you know, pretty much to avoid spreading it to everyone. I had COVID for two weeks. If I take the test. Yes. Yes, I did. I did answer that, that question. Thank you. I couldn't find it when I was backtracking. Um, okay, so, uh, you know, the normal way we create pockets is like this. Super easy. Just like that. And then we're going to put our decorative portion right here. I want it highly reinforced. I do, I do, I do. I think it's better if it's reinforced. It's solid. Especially you're putting your Hello Kitty goodies. Honestly, it's going to be so much fun. Yay! Okay. Next, we process the other one. Yeah, rest, rest, rest is a good idea. And craft. That is the recipe for success. <laughs> Resting and crafting. What are you guys doing tomorrow? I'm going to be working tomorrow. So I'm going to be living vicariously through you guys. Um, I did the cooking last night for today tonight's dinner. So Alexa is in a in a party with friends and we let her stay until midnight she's supposed it's supposed to be a sleepover but i'm like you know what i normally just let my daughter go to um somebody's house if they've gone to my house already i've met their parents and then 
um, her classmate or her friend has already been to my house. So I'm not, I'm not really keen on letting her stay at a friend's house if I haven't met them yet. I don't know. That's just me. I just can't. I just cannot do it. And I told Alexa, this is what I'm where I'm comfortable in. I think as a good compromise is we can let you stay late but not sleep there because I have not met the parents. Six day, that's insane. That's a lot of working. This one is the pocket. I think my pocket decorative pocket is too big so i will edit the instructions because look how big it is but i want it to have i do want it to have like the the stitched portion but whatever it's okay is that pretty i think that's pretty i'll edit everything we will edit everything, my friend. <clears throat> Walk two miles, then my three-year-old grandson has a soccer game, then breakfast date, then rest of the day is open. Probably work on... <gasps> love it! Love it, love it, love it. I wish all parents were like you. I was the same way. I can't... I just... You know, when you have like a gut, I listen to my gut a lot. And if I have a gut feel that I don't want this to happen, I speak up because... You know, if you, you're not comfortable, you're not comfortable. That's that's my daughter. I'm not saying that all people are bad. I'm just saying that I have to be comfortable enough so that, you know, I would have her sleep over. I've never met the parents. Um, her friend hasn't even come to our house. So, no, sorry. Oh, Fritzy's here. Hi, Fritzy. Hi, Miss Tabitha. I... You know, I know that things have changed. Like when we were young, every, everything was safe. There wasn't any serial killers or child abductors that we know of when we were young. But things have changed and you have to be cautious. Like I watch, I watch all these crime videos so I can learn. I can learn. Um, yes, you have to protect your kids. They're your, they're everything. They're everything. Exactly, Grandma Joe. That's what I'm saying. So I explained to Alexa, gut feeling is very important. Um, so I explained to her and she was like, okay, as a way to compromise, we're going to let you still go to the party, but not sleep over. And she was okay, mom. But I think it's good to, to be able to speak up because you might regret it when, if you don't speak up, you know? Hi, Miss Eve. How are you? I hope I said hi to Miss Tabitha. Hi, Miss Tabitha. As parents, you have to. The safety is your number one concern. Yes, you will never know. Exactly, girl. Exactly. Our society is very different now. You'll never know. Thank you, Cousin Sandra. Appreciate it. So you'll never know. That's why I'm like, um, not comfortable. And I told my husband, because initially my husband was the one who said yes to all this. And I said, you know what? The only reason why I'm saying yes is because you said yes. And he said, wait, wait. <laughs> I only said yes because she, she, she said all her friends are sleeping over. And apparently three people canceled. And I'm like, um, okay, I didn't know that part. So we spoke to her and last minute we changed plans and we told her. You're not sleeping over, but you're staying. You're going to the party, but not sleeping over. Oh, there's... Yes, there's serial... Yes, I know. I'm just finding that out now. Auntie Catherine. Like, they had it before. But when we were... Li we were like... they. It was happening. Kidnappings are happening. But we didn't find out about them because there's no internet before. You know, if it's not in the news, you don't know that it happened but right now because of internet and everybody knows everything you're finding out like oh my god the world is not a safe place that is the truth yes yes miss tabitha agreed 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 you have to i know i heard that it's been around 
Yes, I heard a podcast about that. And I'm like, that is so true. You know, serial killers have been here since forever. Like, remember the Moors murder in England? Like, they they were taking kids. But not a lot of people, not everyone knew about them because there was no internet. It was, we never heard of it because it was in Europe. It was in England. So, it's just because of you know, what is availability of, you know, the internet and you're able to find out about these. Like, I, I really believe knowledge is power. Um, yes, hide. Yes. Oh my God, Miss Janet. I love that you're here. Thank you for being here. My, my kids only sleep over one other house. Grandma's. That's it. Yes, yes, yes. I hear you. I hear you. Hi, Miss Jane. You made it. Oh, my God. I'm so glad you made it because it's 6 p.m. now. I'm worried mother does more research than FBI. <laughs> Girl. Yes. Good job. I think it's better to be, to be honest, it's better to be careful and your child miss some events than her or him being hurt. Like, who cares if you miss a, a fun event? I don't care. I What I care about is you being safe and not harmed and heck 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 that is uh, yes that's the last thing i want like i watch all these crime shows to learn to learn and to be mindful wow this is a solid project bro look how solid love it so if you imagine if you can imagine, for example, like you're going to load it up. We're going to decorate this. We're going to decorate it. If you want to give out. Oh, look how cute. Would this be cute? I think this would be so cute. And then if you want to you wanna surprise someone by giving them doodle. Like doodle, um, po doodle pops. Or let me see. If you want to give out doodle pops or sprinkles that will be insane they're gonna freak out for sure they're gonna freak out look what the heck what this would be the most perfect birthday gift honestly right like if if you find if you want to give a present to your friend and she has a specific collection that she absolutely adores man what the heck this would be insane or this is where you can keep leftovers. I think the doodle pops would be so chunky. Look how cute. Insane. <laughs> oh, heck yes. <laughs> what the hey? What the hey? Look, this is what I copied. I copied the doodle pops and made my own. I made it a little bit more complicated because that's what I do. <laughs> Gonna have her friends over at the house and I never yes I you know I told my oh Miss Robin how are you I told my daughter I told my daughter I prefer that you have invite all the friends like I will feed everyone I will bring them to the park I prefer that you guys come to my house because I can be on the lookout I would prefer Everyone to be invited to my house, even if it's like 10 children, that's absolutely fine. Versus my daughter being invited to somebody's house. And I'm not sure if the adult is actually taking care of the children. And not letting them go to the park, like in the middle of the night. Gosh, that would be the worst fear. Um, True, the internet has awakened people. Yes, we'd watch Unsolved. Yes, oh my god, I love, unwatch uh, I love watching Unsolved Mysteries. And then remember that America's Most Wanted, that's another show to watch. Like the dad of Adam Welch. Yes. Jane, where have you been? You should have been watching Unsolved Mysteries back in the day. Yes, I was. <laughs> it could be an uncle, someone's brother. Yes. And not agree. It's not always a stranger. Cousin Sandra, that's so true. My daughter could have her friends over at her house, but I never let her. Yes, yes. I'm being mindful of that, and I try my very best to not be super strict. Um, but, you know, sometimes you have to give them a little bit of freedom so they don't try to escape on you. Is You know, we're trying to do, like, a balance still. 
Um, I'm good, Bonnie. Glad it's Friday. How are you? Hello, 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 everyone who just came in. Are the inserts from a die? Yes, it is from a die. And Miss Debbie, I put a link to it if you don't want to create it from scratch. Yeah, let's go, Miss Christian's house. Yes, come to my house. I would prefer that you guys come to my house than my daughter going to somebody's house. You know? Um, America's Most Wanted, yes. You know, that's the dad of Adam Welch. Did you guys know about the story of Adam Welch, which is like a little boy who got kidnapped? Oh, my goodness. I watched Napped all day. Oh, is it Snapped? Snapped. Oh, my God. Me and my mom, when my mom lived in my house, me and her, that's our jam. Snapped is what we watched, her and I, all the time. All the time. <laughs> working, working, and more working, Christian. Oh, girl, I feel bad for you. Hi, Miss Lisa. Lisa is from Trinidad and Tobago. Hi, Lana. Happy Friday. Miss Barbara, hello. I got my Hocus Pocus. Do you love it, Rob? Robin, do you love your stamps? Because I love my stamps. Was that you who pulled out the Doodle Pops? Yes. <laughs> yes, this one is from the Doodle Pop. So this is my inspiration. Let me show you the die. The moment I saw the die, you guys, I knew like I'm going to doodle pop that. I'm going to doodle popify that. <laughs> this is the die. I think I saw like this one. And it, I think I want to see if I can make this into a Disney castle. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But I can cut it gray. We'll see. But look, I just layered it up. I think I did a reel on Insta. And then I think it's so fabulous. It's, it got bigger. Do you love this collection? I absolutely adore this collection. I just messaged Michelle. And I said, Michelle, please, please, please reserve me all these products. Because I'm going to order it. And she's in a retreat right now. They're doing a, a, an in-person retreat. But I'm like, I want to order it so bad. But I'm going to order. Because I asked my husband if I can order some more of this collection. And he said yes which is awesome <laughs> oh my gosh so i have i think it's gonna be the coolest ever so i think we can put one on here is this the cutest or what i don't know i think it is so you can put a doodle pop on each maybe would that be so cute I think it's crazy adorbs. It is crazy adorable. I'm, I was looking for the, the enamel dots. I don't know where I put the enamel dots. But look at that. And then you can put more here. So see, you can put more here. That'd be so cute packaging. And you can put extra, like you can put um, die cuts and everything. Yes, it is a Scrap Diva. The Scrap Diva designs. Look how cute. I was going to make this into a Disney cat, the Disney castle. Look at that. You can make your own Doodle Pop because this is my inspiration look. I think it looks the same. I think it's fine. You know, it looks great. <laughs> <laughs> if I can say so myself. <laughs> uh, yes, no more. No more shopping. I've gotten any. Good job, good job. Okay, so this one is from Scrap Diva. And then these dies, the pocket dies, is specifically from KS Crafts. I think this is so cute. What the heck? So if you want to put an additional pocket here, that is up to you if you wanted to. Or if you want, you can put embellishments that are like, you know, if you want to send it out just like this and probably use doodle dots. No, it's not doodle dots. Um, what do you call that? The, the thing that sticks? Glue dots. Glue dots. It would be so, so cute. Do, yeah, this one would be so cute. Look. 
so if you wanted to if you've created oh where did it go oh my god so if you want to you can Okay, so I would just put a tiny little glue dot so that your recipient can still, you know, take it out. I think it would be so cute. And, you know, it's safe and sound. It's not, it's not bending or anything. Would this be the cutest ever package ever, ever? Okay, so this one, I think I need to secure it with more. So here, you can put it right here, right? Or you can put another pocket up to you. Would this be the cutest swap ever? Or you can make your Hello Kitty swap. I think it would be so much fun. Hello, Alondra, how are you? Michelle? how are you? I didn't see you hop in. Thank you for being here, everyone. You guys, isn't this so cute? So easy. And then all of the embellishments that you were creating, you can definitely, definitely just let them hang out in here. If you want an additional thing to put there, that's another pocket for you for later. This one is not attaching very well. Let me get another doodle dot. I think it's because it's foam. I'm addicted to foam. Okay. It's it can yeah, it can expand. It can potentially expand, I think. Da -da 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 -da, I just can't get enough. I'm addicted to foam. I don't know why. But I am Okay, so this one, we can put this. Too cute. Too cute. It's too cute. I love the margarita. Yes. So if you have this die, you can create, you can do Christmas margaritas. I think I made Christmas margaritas and I showed it to you guys. You can make summer margaritas obviously halloween oh my god halloween is gonna be so much fun this year you guys elizabeth how are you just woke up hello 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 <laughs> how are you i'm glad you're awake and you can join us for our live look at that isn't that so cute to package package your embellishments would this be the best swap ever, ever? You know, it would be so much fun to create your own. I mean, you can expand to however much you want. It could be as little. You don't have to do all of this. And you can just put a note or like a decoration. It doesn't have to be an embellishment. But man, this can accommodate whatever you need. It has that much capacity i think you're gonna have so much fun loading this up honestly honestly pia you oh my gosh pia you're back yeah how are you pia you've been busy at work look how cute oh my goodness this one i think i need to use like um i need to put a paper clip of some sort because it's coming off so I'm going to remove that but you know if you want you can put if you want to use a bow or like a trim or a ribbon to tie it and tie it shut you can but you have to do that before you attach that layer I think this would be the cutest for this I don't know what do you guys think or we can we can make the flip-flops. What do we think? I'm not sure. I have this prepped. Would this be cuter? Would this be cuter as the... Right there? What would it be? Would be cute? Or the... Or the... This one. What do you guys think? 
Happy Saturday. Wait till tomorrow after six. I love it. Um, well, this one, this one is um, a doodle pop that I made using the Scrap Diva. And I copied the actual doodle pop right here. Uh, you're done shopping. <laughs> yes, the flip-flops. No, the castle. Yes. What? Which one? How did you get? Flip-flops, sand castle. Flip oh, wow. We are. I'm getting a lot more votes for flip-flops, you guys. Okay. So, I may have to put this inside then. You know, as part of the... Right there. Oh, that would be so cute. Let me put let me put a doodle dot. I think I have to secure this a little bit better. Isn't that so cute? And then you still have space in the pockets for some more goodies. Okay, so let's do the flip. Flippity flops. Okay, so I think I need to attach this one first. Um, <clears throat> the paper and flip flops, yes, it's the same colors. It is the same colors because it's the the uh, matching paper. Yes, it looks like an over-the-top, over-the-top castle. You know, you know, I was thinking of when I was constructing that is, you know how those, if you go to the beach, like in the Philippines, we have a beach called Boracay, and they have like sand art competition. And one time I saw that they had this gigantic castle that is hyper extended. It was so big and so intricate. And that's what I was thinking when I was creating the sand castle. Is like a an extra. A sand castle that is extreme extra. Yes. As you can see, I'm trying not to use the doodle pops. I could easily put the doodle pops on top and call it good. Like, okay, call it good, done, but no, I cannot. I am a lover of... I am a lover of the doodle pops. I know it's not a good idea to do that, but... It's not a good idea to hoard it and not use it, but I cannot come... To the conclusion of using it for myself. Yes, yes, yes. These are flip-flops from KS Craft. They released this last year, a long time ago. But I think it's perfect. Used to say, Bonnie, you have to say what you think when you think. I said pretty much. <laughs> the flip-flops, yes, these flip-flops are from KS Crafts. They're like last year. They even have flowers. This one is the KS Crafts. They have flowers. And yeah, they have matching flowers actually. And we can put the matching flowers. For, probably. So this one is the KS Crafts die. The flippity flops. And it has a shaker. It has these. Look how cute that is. You can just use like plain paper. And then they have a stripe option. Oh, nope. You have the stripe. Isn't that cute? I think it gives you so much. So much. Oh my god, Edward is here. Hi, Edward. How are you? Okay, so this one, I need to get my... Let me attach this here. Okay, I'm going to erase the adhesive. Okay. Okay. And then I'm putting adhesive. I'm putting embossing powder here. Embossing tool. Okay. And then I think it's super, super cute. It's going to be so much fun. 
And then I don't have a pre-mix yet for it, but I will. We're gonna we're gonna make a pink and orange and blue. Did I tell you guys that the Hobby Lobby close to me is open? Oh my god. Bye, Tabitha. Thank you. Have an amazing weekend, girl. Can you measure the flip-flop? The flip-flop is... Okay. The flip-flop is about... Three and three quarters, Miss Lauren. Three and three quarters. Good night, Miss Tabitha. I hope you have an amazing weekend. Um three and three quarters and obviously you can put a face and i was so inspired by this collection because look look at the flip-flops isn't that i'm just copying everything in the collection because they're so cute i cannot isn't that so cute yes made them shakers three and a half inches i think it's gonna be so so much fun wait let me get Oh, just a moment. I am going to get some, some sequins. Sequins, and we're going to create. I have a spoon. Where do I mix it at? Wait, let me organize because this table is going crazy. Okay, let me let me organize this real quick. Okay. Okay, this is necessary. Okay, so let us let us put away the stuff that is not necessary and get our stuff. Okay, so no, they were small. Flip flops in my cart. Yes, 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 yes. I want to use these. I got these from the Dollar. Uh, no, not from the Dollar Tree. From um, Hobby Lobby, like what I told you. The Hobby Lobby close to me is, you guys, two minutes. Literally just across the bridge. Oh. Crazy. Crazy close. And my husband, I was having a bad day. And my husband says, do you want to go to Hobby Lobby? Isn't that the cutest thing ever for a husband to say? When you're having a bad day, he's like, do you want to go to Hobby Lobby? That is the sweetest, I think, people could tell me, could say to me. Girl, you're having a bad day. You should go to Hobby Lobby. <laughs> the sequence, yes, the sequence is from Hobby Lobby. This one is sprinkles from the Dollar Tree. Is that so cute? I think I need more white. I'm waiting for it to expire. Two minutes. Oh, it is so close, Cousin Sandra. It's not even funny. It is that close. Man, it is insane. I know, I married the right guy. Oh, Miss Tina, how are you? <laughs> Your husband says the same thing. <laughs> they just know the right thing to say. If you've been together for years, they know what gives you joy which is hobby lobby i think i need a little bit of green in there okay i'm just sealing it up because i just got this oh i'm gonna show you guys on sunday i'm gonna post my haul video of the craft store you're not gonna believe it and if you ever go somewhere close to roseville you have to let me know so i can send you the address or tell you where to find that store. It's called Create Store. And you're going to love it. They have so many punches. They have so many stamps. It's crazy. 
Is that cute? I think I need something darker. Okay, let me put these away. Give me a second. I need to find something else. Offered to bring you to Hobby Lobby. Aww. That is so nice. That is so nice. Drop by Frank Garcia. That's amazing. Shopping for you, Miss Gina. So lucky. It's so close. It's dangerous. So I'm being mindful to not take advantage because, you know, if you take advantage, it's going to stop. Okay, I think I need... I don't know. Oh, this is perfect. I don't know where I got this from, but I think we will add it to our mix. I actually need a watermelon, which I don't know where to get from. Like I said, I need green, honestly. Because there's green in here. But this is a good start. It's a good start. We're going to improve that mix eventually, my friend. But I think it's a great start. We're good. We're good. We'll try it. Okay. So... I don't want to hear any more hauls <laughs> with the scrapbook supplies. All I need. Girl, I feel you, girl. <laughs> Tell him rain check. So this is what my this is one of my favorite tools right now from the Dollar Tree. And if you're making a shaker, you can just you just need a nudge separating. It's perfect. Look. Without actual disruption. And then I use it for like anything and everything it's one of my favorite new tools okay let's fill it you know my favorite thing to do is to overfill these things and that is always a big mistake for me like always always so don't do don't do my mistake and overfill them it's not cute okay I'm gonna stop there because I'm trying not to make a mistake. And then we put the glue on here. Local Hobby Lobby Michaels doesn't have much. Oh, that sucks. Hi, Sherry. How are you? Hello, hello. Welcome to your first live. Lake girl, beach girl, crafty girl. Sherry. Hello, Sherry. You know, since you're a beach girl, this collection would be perfect for you because it's called, uh, I think... What is this called? Because it has a be lots of beach elements on it. It's called... Oh, I forget. <laughs> I'm sure I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to find out. Wait, let me look. Yikes. What is the name? I've been out of words right now. Uh, summer Seaside. Seaside Summer is the name of the collection. And your name is so appropriate for this collection. Welcome to the crafty community, Sherry. You have a lot of crafty sisters here. Um, it's an amazing community. Cleaning my craft room. Love it. I'm trying to declutter my craft space, but every time. Oh my gosh, Pia, Pia. Same here, girl. I do the exact same thing. I just end up like rearranging. You really have to be mindful of what you bring in, honestly. It's the step, the, the best way to go. Being mindful of what's coming in. And when you're buying, this is what Rachel told me. Rachel is my guru because she is very wise. So, hi, Leanna, how are you? I've almost, I worked at hi for almost 12 years hello 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 on my day off thank you thank you welcome thank you for being here miss liana um and she said if you're shopping 
and you cannot think in your mind where you're going to put it, think again. Because where are you going to put that, you know? Rachel is wise when it comes to, like, organization. Cracker Barrel this morning. Okay, so I am trying with all my heart to not shake it. You know, that's my favorite thing to do. Is to shake it immediately. I couldn't stop myself from shaking it, but I have to this time. So cute. It's so simple. Such a simple flip-flop that you found here. Look how cute. I just look at all these elements. And you know we're going to make that. And that. And that. And that. Oh my god. I'm giving you like... Rach, we were just talking about you. Oh my god. Denise, how are you? <laughs> Rach, we were just talking about you. So funny. <laughs> Denise, we miss you. How have you been? So, while you were not here yet, Rach and Denise, this is what we made. And it's called the Major Pocketbook. The Major Pocketbook. I'll do a flip through in a little bit. I'm just trying to get my flippity flop to close. It's not closing this top part for some reason. It's like surgery. It's like surgery. You have to make sure that the sutures adhere before you let go of the skin. So many friends. Thank you, friends, for being here. Love, love, love it. I thought of you, Denise, today because I was watching Alicia's video. And I was watching Alicia unbox Rachel's um, rack. And then I saw I saw your version, you know, your greeting form character. And it's so cute. And I'm like, oh, that's Denise with her boots. It's still not closing very well. So anywho, I thought about you and I'm like, where's Denise? Thank you, thank you for the thumbs up, everyone. Appreciate it. It's so cute and the size is perfect. Heck. Heck, would this be would this be the cutest mini flip-flop mini album? What the hey? <laughs> that would be so crazy. <laughs> Oh my gosh, like, let me see my uh, mini album. <laughs> it's so tiny. Uh, Nancy, how are you, Nancy? I need this paper in my life. Yes. I know where I can put it. Oh my God, Kim. Hello, Kim. How are you? This is perfect for beach um, pictures. I mean, it doesn't have to be like recent, you know, because COVID happened. And I'm sure we all had beach vacations that didn't happen. This is not closing on me. Sucks. You know, I have an emergency friend right here. That can... This is my big gun right here. <clears throat> if you're not being compliant, my, my, my good friend, the Sherbonder, is here to save the day. Oh, it's still not closing. What the hey? Um, what was I saying? I forget what I was saying. Oh, yes, Kim. So this would be perfect for like a beachside adventure. Anyone going to stamp anything in the retreat? Anything retreat? Stamp anything? How fun. I want to make one. Are you cleaning tonight? Bonnie, I th Bonnie, are you off or are you still working today? Ramon. <laughs> Trying to be mindful of what I get. Luckily, yes. Very picky. My collections. I've been paper crafting. Yes. Agreed, agreed, agreed. Hi, Miss Tia. How are you? Okay. So, I think my big gun worked. Oh, I can finally shake it. Oh, that, the glue got stuck there. Okay. I'm going to let that dry. That took for a thousand years. That took a thousand years to, to stick. But I think it's going to be so, so cute. I only, I only die cut one. One flip flop. But I think I'm looking at it now and it's 
stinking cute. I think I'm going to die got a little bit more, maybe two more of matching flippity fluffs. Anyone live in Orlando? We can meet. It's in October. How fun. I miss Ramon. I know Ramon was the was the man. Ramon got everything done. Tip top, ready to go, always hot and ready. But it was it was over. It was a great relationship, but he had to go. Five big houses this week, and I gotta go tomorrow and cover my mother's clients because she's at the art for 40 days. Wow. That's a lot of shifts to cover for, for one person. You guys will get a kick out of this. I'm in the nursery right now, bathing in newborn mommy sleep. A newborn mommy is sleeping. Oh my god, Denise, that's so cute. I love the smell of newborns. It's insanely so amazing. It's like the smell of heaven. Question please, I kind of remember, but not certain. But I saw a video of a crafter. She had a full alphabet die and had a cool container. So each alphabet had a slot. Do anyone know? The Ark in Kentucky, which container? And who is it, please? Yeah, I've never seen that. I want I want to see it too. I want to see it too. Yes, it is intense. That's a lot of working for Bonnie. I can't believe you created the flip-flop from the paper. Yay! I'm so glad you like it. Hi, Miss Elizabeth. What a lovely craft make. Your channel is amazing. You make such lovely... Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Miss Elizabeth. I appreciate it. So cute, man. Always color changes everything. Um, have I showed you guys this? This is going to be in my in a future. I don't know if you've seen it. Pardon pardon the, the mess, okay. But I want to... I don't know if this is something that you guys are going to be interested in. This is an organizer. I showed Rachel this already. But this is an organizer specifically for your um, thickers. You know, we have some thickers. I did keep maybe this much. I don't have a lot of thickers, but it's, I think, perfect in somebody's desk. And it holds washi perfectly. Washi perfectly. And I use this one from... I use... You're going to see, like, those... What do you call it? Like a, a little saw. Saw-like projections. And it's perfect for washi. It works like... Okay, let me show you. Let me show you. I have one hand to use. Give me a sec. But I don't know if this is something. This is a thicker sticker holder. Oh my god. Cheryl, this is perfect for you, babe. Okay, look. It's a washi compartment. And I used... Look. Yikes. See? You can remove it. I used... Okay, I got this from, okay, I'm, now I'm making a mess. Look, this is from, like the aluminum foil. Remember the aluminum foil? Right there, the aluminum foil on the box. So I removed this, I cut it in half, and I put half of it in here. Right there. That's for aluminum foils. And and then I just attached one. And then I still have left to create for the tutorial. Um, but that's, you know, from the aluminum foil box that you're going to throw anyways. Reuse and recreate, right? So I think it's going to be so much fun creating your own. I love, love, love creating my own organizers because... It will match my and then I just realized that if it's perfectly these um, what do you call these post-its the itty bitty post-its so imagine if you have multiple colored post-its and you're a post-it lover bro this would be so perfect to store your post-its insane 10 pounds it's one of those big gamer boxes so now I'm ignoring her text. She wants me to open it in a video. That is so cute. You should open it though. Um, Pia, please share with us it once you find it. That would be so cute. 
This one is not a doodle bug washi. It's a do. Uh, it's a washi set from. It's a washi set from Barely Arts. It's their macaron, macaron washi, and they have more colors in the set. But I didn't put it because I want to put the washi for the Let's Get Crafty collection in here. But I think it's very functional that you'll be able to cut your washi with this perforation right here. Um, it, ju it just looks like it. Hi, Miss Stace. How are you? Welcome, welcome. Happy Friday. I just wanted to show you guys that. And I, I was wondering if you guys are interested in seeing a, a tutorial for that. It's called a sticker thicker. I'm going to call it sticker thicker organizer. Is what we're gonna be calling it sticker thicker organizer but I think it's gonna be so so much fun to create I know Edward Edward would love to make that because Edward loves creating embellishment um, embellishment or crafty organizers Edward what do you think Edward I have two boxes of the Reynolds wrap yes perfect not funny I don't know whether to tell her I need stuff then maybe she won't send me anything that is so nice of her and thoughtful though bonnie isn't that so sweet i will but it's heavy oh 10 pounds is huge i love the organizer to totally he provide the ultimate i know i love that i love that you created that it gives me i am so truly honored when you guys create my tutorials it just gives me so much joy and Edward, I will release this and I hope you can recreate it and put it in your craft room. I found her cutting dies and the organizer. Who is it? Who is it, Pia? I hope you can share it with us. I get these boxes like from Denise. That is so nice having a crafty friend. Edward Rachel is the organizer. Yes, she is the organization queen. Yana Smakula. And then she has that. Yay! Thank you, Edward. Yana Smakula. Did you guys know Yana Smakula is in Ukraine? Yeah, I donated. Um, I donated some money to her, uh, like community. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Pia, for the link. I appreciate it. Uh, open tab. I'm going to pause that and watch that later. <laughs> yes, Rach. I think you're the organize the organization queen. Thank you. Thank you, Cousin Sandra, for the link. What is the link? Assemble and store. Ooh, that is crazy. Assemble and die cutting station. That is awesome. Custom sentiment birthday cards with alphabet. Oh, I love it. Thank you for all the links. I appreciate it. I'm rubbish at shakers. They never really go. I know initially, Elizabeth, initially the shakers don't go very well. But just keep on practicing. Give yourself some grace because you're learning a new skill. Um, don't Don't be frustrated. Just keep at it. Um, and then you're going to get better and then you're going to get better. So this is what we made today. I think this is going to be so cute for the front right here. Wait, let me get, um, let me get an embellishment. Wait, stand by. I think it's going to be so cute. Seaside summer chit chat. Okay, let me get a chit chat. Thank you, son. Thank you, Sandra, for the link. Because then you don't understand the amount of stuff this woman. That is amazing. That is amazing. That is a gift. Having um, a very generous friend is such a gift. I'm happy for you, Bon. She can walk to misery. I'll pick her up and I'll bring her. Sometimes I forget everything. Yes. Everything that is. That you know it's a skill. Everything is a skill. And you just have to. 
give yourself some grace and you know you're not going to be perfect at the start and that's okay that's what practice is for practice makes better and it's okay not to be amazing at the start right it's okay you don't have to be perfect immediately but give yourself that time tropical beach give yourself that time to adjust and to have fun make sure you have fun with this also fun times good times oh my god this is insane how cute this is <laughs> so cute hello there good times oh heck yeah so cute enabler alert urban gems has 25 wow 25 percent off it's a big deal thank you lana hello there good times thank you so much lana for the enabler alert we appreciate it summer sale everyone Thank you so much, Auntie Catherine. I am so, so happy you like it. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I am in love with this paper collection. Mm -hmm. Like, in love. Like, I want to get and hoard. I'm just waiting for Michelle to get out of her, um, to be her, to have her retreat done so I can get my stuff shipped. Good times. Hello there, good times. Gosh, this is adorbs. I am so happy. <laughs> let me just get a... Let me just get this. Yes, do not use my coupon code. I don't think I have a coupon code anymore. That's doodle bug. I'm sure, Miss Tia, I'm sure they have a doodle bug this year. I just, I'm so excited to see what it looks like. I'm always, always, always excited. So cute. I think I need a little bit more padding. Where is that? Okay, let me get a little bit more padding because this requires a little bit of something thicker. Something thicker. Okay. So I'm just trying to get it all squared away. Anniversary! Happy anniversary! Thank you so much. I'm so glad you guys like it. My baby is going to be 20 at the end of the month. Wow! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Is that going to be Olivia? Or, okay, I'm trying to figure out where to put things. I think good would be here and times would be. What do we think? I think that is so cute. I think it's going to be amazing. Amazing, amazing. The code worked. Oh my gosh. Wow. I'm so, so happy. Can you buy Doodle from any stores or just online? I think you can only buy it from online. Um, any, any one of my moderators, can you guys put a link to Three Craft Chicks? For Miss Nancy, just in case she wants to get any doodle bug from Three Craft Chicks. I would love it. And Miss Nancy, you can use coupon code Christian10. Okay, should I start die cutting? Yes, start die cutting for sure. Yes, heck yes, Auntie Catherine. You have to. It's the funnest thing to do. It's so much fun to die cut. I promise you're going to have a great time. Yes, please. Miss Susie, how are you? So glad you're here. Thank you for coming. Happy Friday Night Live. I'm creating the title just in case you're wondering what I was doing. Gosh, this is ultimate cute. 
cuteness. Ultimate cutie. Dang it. Why are you so cute? Why you gotta be so cute? Gosh. Bugs, how are you, Bugs? How are you? Welcome, welcome. Happy Friday. Look at this cuters. Look at this cutie pie right here. I think ultimately, because it's so uneven, I have to do this. Wow, that's so cute. Thank you, Cousin Sandra. Here's the link. Um, Yeah, you have to order it online. Thank you, Cousin Sandra, for the link. Christian, do you have the Sizzix switch? If so, how are your plates? My, my plates are warped. Yes, my plates are warped. In a month's time, I couldn't use it anymore. It was very disappointing, um, Pia. So that I haven't used my switch in forever. Very disappointed. So I'm back to my old big kick, which I've had for more than 10 years. Um, thank you, thank you. Christian code is Christian 10. Yes. Gina, how are you? Happy Friday. Oh my gosh. Here in Reno, we were out. Where did you go? Did you go to the Japanese place? Like the the sushi, the sushi place that you always go to? So much fun. Sun, good times. The sweet life. Thank you, thank you so much. I'm so glad you guys like it. Thank you, thank you, cousin. I got a I got to say I've used the Impress so much. I'm so glad. So the Impress is, for you, the Impress is better than the Switch. I'm disappointed with the plates, to be honest. I'm going to have to sign off and go back to bed. Good night, Miss Elizabeth. Thank you so much for being here. And yours has not warped the Impress. Mine has warped. And maybe I was doing, maybe it's user error. But, you know, user error... I'm sure it's user error, but I don't I don't know how to how to address it other than the fact that I should get some new plates, which I don't want to do. Hey, Miss Barbara, thank you so much for the heart. That is so sweet. Oh my God, I just started coloring die cut. Yes, I love that you love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Coloring the die cuts is a game changer for sure. Let me show you. Let me show you the thing that I colored, like this one. You know, some pieces are just so small, and I colored these. Like this one I colored. I'm not going to cut that in red, so I cut majority of them in white. And then, yeah, this one I colored. I colored the paper. So I pretty much cut this in gray, black, and white, and then I just colored the rest of the stuff. So I think that is so, so much fun. I have heard quite a few people. Yes, is and it's very disappointing to be honest. It's very disappointing, but maybe I don't know. Uh, it's my first time using the switch. I've never had a switch before. It, it could be me, so don't quote me on that. But my experience is mine warped. I think I'm gonna add like a dangle right here. But this is what we did today. This is called the major pocketbook. Major pocketbook. Yours is hella warped too. Oh my god. So it's not just me, cousin Sandra. So it's not just me, because mine warped in a month's time. So I got it for my birthday. It warped by May 1st. That it's hard to use. Like you feel like you're endangering the life of your machine. Like I'm not gonna mess with my machine. That's a hundred something. So I figured until I figure out this warping situation, I'm not gonna use the switch. I know I could. I could just use my big kick. Um, I know you can you can use your big kick, but it's just disappointing. That's all. 
Can you put your plates in boil? I did. I did that. I put my plates in boiling water. It did not resolve. It got better slightly. First of all, it was such an effort to do the boiling thing. The boiling thing, such a huge effort to the fact like you're afraid that you're going to put boiling water on yourself. I think the only solution to this, if you love the switch so much, is buy some new plates. But it's guaranteed it's going to warp. And they said that doing the reverse button on the switch makes it warp more. I don't know. I don't know. It was huge disappointment. I have the Gemini. My plates haven't warped for years. See? It is probably the machine. And they probably need to improve the switch machine. I don't know. And all the videos that I watch, all the machines, they said that they warp. The Impress said... Oh, so the Impress does not warp. That's amazing. How much is the Impress, Bonnie? I just bought a new pack today. See? Cousin Sandra, that's the only way. I tried the hot water maneuver... That didn't work for me at all, to be honest. I got the Magic Map package. Yeah, you have to buy a new one. This is a YouTube video, Paige Evans. Yes, it's just, I tried hot. Yeah, it doesn't fix it that much. It may be very slight. It's not significant enough for you to feel comfortable using your machine. That's my honest opinion. I tried it too, Sherry. It didn't help much. Found a Cricut Explorer without a cord at the thrift store yesterday. Does anyone have experience with that machine? I'm a silhouette girl. Cricut, Cricut Explorer. Anybody have experience on the Cricut Explorer? I tried to use my Cricut Impress to fix the plate. Did not work. Ah, oh, that sucks. It's only 10 bucks. Kind of tempted. Yep, it's a good idea to get it. 10 bucks. That's amazing. On my videos, the Gemini had warping. Robin loves a cricket. Yeah, the precision plate is legit. The precision plate is legit. Okay, so let's look at what we have. I may have to include this. So this is our, this is our major pocketbook because we have the mini pocketbook right here that we did in one of the lives, and it was using the pocket die from KS Craft. So I added some Pusheen stickers right here that I got from Amagen. Ugh. It is getting out of order, but that's okay. I had it all fixed and pretty. It would be so cute for swaps, wouldn't it? Right there, right there. This is the mini pocketbook. Look how thin it is. It's a very thin mini pocketbook. This one is the major, major pocketbook. And this is what it looks like. And there's a lot of room for growth if you wanted to. I have left everything in the description box below for you. If you wanted to create it. And I will put the edits later after I'm done with a live. Um, I've watched videos for a week. And I watch every single video on every, every machine I think. Anna, if you never bought anything, 15% off. It's over $100 shipping. That's a, that's a great option. Auntie should be able to find a cord. Yeah, you can find a cord online. My impressed magnet is warped, but I was thinking I was using the wrong sandwich. I bought the big ones. Pusheen is too cute. Yes, agreed, agreed, agreed. I was thinking about the Cricut Joy, but not sure if it's worth getting. I Jane, I don't know, to be honest, because I don't even use my own Cricut. Rachel is going to help me. <laughs> For years and years, Rachel wanted me to use the Cricut, but I haven't bit the bullet. I still am confused with the technology, and I know that I can learn, but I know I should learn. I should learn with my Cricut, but I have so many dies to play with that I feel like, do I need to... But I know I do when it comes to projects for my kids. Anywho, so this is the inside flap. I'm trying to secure everything. Inside flap. And then, you know you can put more things in here. I just don't have like a sticker that I can put in here. But this is an amazing pocket to be honest. You know, you can put. Look how much you can put in there. 
see. You can put lots and lots. Yeah. Yeah, you can put a lot of goodies in there. It's very sturdy. But you have to put a paper clip so it holds it because it's upside down. You know what I mean? So that is huge space for you, my friend. I was gifted Sizzix Big Shot Machine. Yes, it is phenomenal. Phenomenal, phenomenal. Really helps. Yes, it helps with memory keeping. Okay, so this is our up top flap. This is the side flap, okay? Just in case you don't know the verbiage. This one is a sandcastle doodle pop that I made using the um, Scrap Diva. These are dies. This is a die from Scrap Diva. This is a die from KS Crafts. They're beach. And then when you open it up, you open it up. It has so many tuck spots. There's three tuck spots. One, two, and three. And if you also want to decorate it, by all means, yes. I just didn't have the time to decorate it right now. But it would be so cute to decorate the bottom portion. Whatever you like, you can you can do with with it whatever you prefer. But this is how you close it. There's so much potential for this project. And I definitely believe this is going to be perfect for your swaps. The major pocketbook will be here to stay. The tutorial is there for you. So easy to make. It is so much fun to make a boatload of these. Maybe like make a boatload of these in white and then decorate later like a kit for you and your friends. I don't know. It will be so much fun to do. Oh, like a lot of vinyl. Yes, the vinyl thing is going to be so much fun. Thank you, thank you, Robin. Put mine in the dumpster. I did 3D letters for my niece's birthday. Oh, yes, I see a lot of those. That must, must be so much fun. Yes, Patty Swap. This would be so cute for you put embellishments inside. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Um... Robin's August 26, 12 a.m. Big shop at Impress is a game changer, I think. I used mine maybe three to four times this year because it's so, yes, time-consuming and mixed. Thank you so much, Christian. With your switch, did you use one plate? I use both, um, Gina. I use both plates to cut onto and, um, yeah. I I tried the water hot water thing multiple times, maybe three times. Still didn't help. So I stopped using my switch. I was hugely disappointed. Mine would never cut properly in the paper. Oh, that sucks, Jane. I think we all have our own like nuances when it comes to crafting. There's certain things that are non-negotiable for you that is negotiable for me and certain things. So that's why it would be good if I think it would be great if Sizzix did a survey on their switch plates and then and then if they did they can replace all the switch so they can have happy customers that would would come back for their new products I mean did you leave the plate to cut in the other one with no cuts in it yes yes I did that Gina that's what I did. So one to cut and one to put on top. And then the one that's getting cut all the time, I'm doing it fr um, front and back. I don't know if it's under warranty. Suck the patient like a vacuum cleaner. <laughs> Sucks up dirt. <laughs> but, you know, I think ultimately it's up to you what you what are you willing to put up with some people it's a non it's a negotiable it's a non-negotiable maybe it's just convenient and i've been doing a lot of crafting in the living room recently because we're watching virgin river in the living room with the fam so it was convenient to just bring the big shot anyways this is so cute i cannot deal with it um Hi Gina for my switch then I cut a die in the sandwich and get both scratched I know I try not to get both of them scratched but it just still happens sometimes I wish they did I wish they did 
I lived on YouTube for like a month. For the first month I got the machine to learn. I hear you. I know you want to maximize your machine. I always do that too. I watch a crap of videos. It's still under warranty. Oh, okay. So do do I contact scrapbook.com? Scrapbook.com is where I got it from. Who do I contact? Scrapbook.com or Sizzix? I'm on season four of Virgin River. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Anybody watching Virgin River? I'm on season four. I'm so happy to be watching it. Mine was from years ago. It's no longer supported by Silhouette. Oh. Oh, Pia, I'm using my precision plate on the bottom, then my die, then the cutting plate. It works fine. So, you... Okay. I can try that. I can try to use that, Gina. Just you. I would contact both. Sizzix. Okay, I can contact both. I can call me. I learned plenty from Melody Lane, who unfor unfortunately passed away. I think Melody Lane's daughter and son is managing the website right now. I know. What season are you in, um, Pia? I love, love, love it. And who's your favorite character in Virgin River? Don't tell me it's Mel. Nobody can say it's Mel or Jack. Somebody else other than Mel and Jack. Who is, who is your favorite character in Virgin River? Let me know. I absolutely love Hope. Hope is so cute. <laughs> okay, I will contact them. I will contact... P.S. on season three. Yeah, my silhouette only runs. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. It's John. Who's John? Paige, of course. Paige is so cute. Paige is gorgeous. And creature. That's why I'm looking into a new one. That's a good idea. Did you register your switch? Did I register? Gina, I don't think I did. I never do that. <laughs> Maybe I should have done that for my switch. They're super cute. And I'm at the season where Paige left because of Wes. Yes, yes, yes. One year warranty. So that's perfect. I can still contact Sizzix and scrapbook.com to see what they can do for me. That's what I'm worried about, Bonnie. I mean, they would always... Of course, they would give new products to the market. And yeah. But, you know, the Sizzix, is, the Sizzix Switch is relatively new. It, I bought it for April for my birthday. And it was relatively new then. I think it was released somewhere in March. So you guys are right, maybe. Well, you actually get one year. The other two years were free at the time. I think you need to contact Sizzix, not scrapbook.com. Okay, I'm going to contact Sizzix, um, Gina. I sent a message to scrapbook.com in, um, in their Instagram and they didn't respond. So I'm going to contact Sizzix now. talk me out of it <laughs> anyway that is it for me today you guys um email them both okay i would email both scrapbook.com and Sizzix to see if they can do anything about my plates because i love the machine the machine works well it's fabulous you don't have to do this it's just the the I know I'm afraid that I'm going to destroy my machine by using some warped plates. So that's that's why we're at this moment talking about it. Smaller manual. Just as good. How fun! Jane, I have thought of getting the brother scanning cut because I don't think I keep anything. Buying things, but I don't know. I haven't researched Yes, yes, yes. Thank you so, so much for being here. Let's do a quick last look on our major pocketbook. And the description, the, me the detailed measurements is in the description box. This is super, super cute for swaps. If you're part of Patty Swap, this would be so perfect for you. Or any kind of swap, actually. 
if you want to do that. Thank you, Gina, for the link. So this is what we have. Super cute. If you don't want to put this, you don't have to. But there's a lot of pockets. It's very interactive. And you can put a boatload of embellishments in there to give to your swap partner. Anyway, I hope you, if you like this video, I hope you can give it a thumbs up. It tells YouTube that you like my content and it just makes the YouTube algorithm people happy <laughs> and sends people my way. Thank you so much, everyone. I hope you have an amazing weekend. I'm going to be working this weekend, so I'm going to be really quiet. But I hope you give it a try. The major pocketbook, the description, uh, the detailed instructions is in the description for you. I hope you can give it a try. Thank you, everyone. Love you guys. Au revoir.